As summer vacations bring a delight to students, Rajan is visiting his nani's place to spend a few days with his cousin and relatives. Nani, can I have a cold drink? No, Rajan. These cold drinks do not have any nutritional value. Please go and pluck lemons from our kitchen garden. I'll make fresh lemonade instead. Wear your slippers before you step out to the garden. Oh, this mango looks delicious. Wait, Rajan. We should wash the fruits thoroughly before eating them. Yes, you are right. Rajan and Ankit, lunch is ready. Come, let's eat. Wash your hands before you come. Lata aunty, please don't put spinach and curd for me. I don't like its taste. Rajan, you and Ankit are at a growing age right now and should eat a balanced diet to grow up well and healthy. You see Rajan, wheat and rice with some butter and vegetables gives us energy. Whereas, pulses and dairy products have protein which helps in building body. The leafy vegetable and salads are rich in vitamins and minerals which protect our body from diseases and infections and keep our skin, hair and eyes healthy. Rajan, since you like having paneer, I can add that in spinach for you to enjoy it. Thank you Nani for telling me this and yes Lata Aunty, I would love to eat Palak Paneer. Rajan, would you like to play with me and my friends in the grounds outside? Let's go. I enjoy playing outdoor games. Make sure you both clean yourself thoroughly after playing. Lata Aunty, why is it important to always stay clean? Children, it's important to maintain personal hygiene and wash hands frequently as it prevents you from germs, illness and diseases like diarrhea, pneumonia and COVID-19. Good personal hygiene practices keep us safe and healthy. My class teacher told me that along with washing hands, we should also take bath daily and brush our teeth twice. Absolutely! It is also essential to maintain food hygiene. We should check the food items before buying and clean them after getting it home. We must store the raw and cooked food separately and keep them covered to avoid cross-contamination. Food should be cooked fresh in clean vessels and leftovers should be cooled and stored neatly. Is that why you used iron vessels to cook food? Ma had told me that it enhances nutritional value of food. I will keep this in mind from now on. I am making coconut and jaggery laddus. They will be ready by the time you are back. I find it very unhygienic for people to urinate in open. Our country is already dealing with issues related to open defecation. Uncle, can we talk for a moment? It is not good to urinate in the open. Our government is running a cleanliness campaign, so it would be great if you please use a public toilet the next time. Yes, I am sorry. I'll use a public toilet from now on. Thank, Thank you, you, Uncle. People should know harmful effects of such practices and open defecation. This fecal material can contaminate water that reaches our households. Yes, and insects can carry these germs into the households and contaminate our food. Sad that people are not careful about this. Jyoti fell down. Let's help her out. Oh no! It's my friend Jyoti. Let's rush there fast. A few days ago, we were playing and she fell unconscious. Later, she told me that she hadn't eaten lunch that day. Let's take her to the nearby health center and someone please inform her parents. Doctor, our friend fainted. Kindly check if she is alright. She looks weak and anemic. Jyoti, did you have breakfast today? No, doctor. I normally skip my breakfast because I don't get time to have it. Jyoti, this is not good. Many teens skip breakfast. But this meal is important for getting energy to make it through the day and it leads to better academic performance. Eating nuts and leafy vegetables prevents iron deficiency, also known as anemia. 
If you ever feel suddenly tired or dizzy, please inform elders or visit nearest doctor or a clinic. Remember Jyoti, most girls of your age start menstruating and go through blood loss every month. So it is essential for you to take iron rich diet. Our government runs programs to support adolescent health by providing weekly iron and folic supplements as well as celebrating National Deworming Day to help prevent infections and diseases that cause you any harm. Yes doctor, this was mentioned in our school textbook also. We will make sure that we take care of our health, sanitation and nutrition. Nutritional needs are higher during adolescence as this is a phase of rapid growth and development. Students, along with a balanced diet, you should take care of your sanitation and health as they are equally important. A balanced nutrition supports the physical growth of the body and prevents future health problems.